Hey guys, it's Aptrix here. Today we'll be taking a look at one of the best screen mirroring tool which lets you stream your mobile phone directly on your PC as it supports both Android and iOS devices. iMobi Any Mirror supports both offline and Wi-Fi streaming up to 4K 60fps. We'll be definitely trying out some games later on and thanks to iMobi for sponsoring this video. So let's try out Any Mirror. The installation and setup procedure is pretty simple. All you do is just press one button and wait for few seconds. Afterwards, it will ask you to choose the device which you want to use, for example, Android or iOS devices. I'll go with Android for today's video. So after selecting your device, you need to connect it using a USB cable. I'll also go through the Wi-Fi connection later on. But first of all, let me show you guys the preferences. You can open settings and increase or decrease screen mirroring resolution along with frame rate. You can go all the way up to 4K 60fps but I recommend you guys to keep it at 1080p resolution at 60 frame rate if you don't have a powerful Wi-Fi. You can set the same resolution and frame rate for iOS devices as well. Now just use any USB cable to connect your mobile phone with your PC. Once you do that, just wait for few seconds and you will get a prompt about USB use. Just choose file transfer. Now open settings and search for developer options. Scroll down and make sure to enable USB debugging or else this will not work. Afterwards, you will get a prompt like this. Just tap on allow and you will be all set. Wait for few seconds until the PC recognizes your mobile device. And here we go. It will start streaming your mobile display directly on your monitor and just take a look at this. There is literally zero delay which directly start off by trying out a game which is Karek Street. As you know Karek Street is just mobile specific game, it's not released for PC. By the way just tap on this mobile layout option at the top and you will get mobile borders on your PC screen which looks a lot better. I also recommend you guys to connect a controller to enjoy even more immersive gameplay experience. If not, then still it will be very fun gaming experience as you are able to see. I am playing Karek Street with amazing resolution and there isn't even any noticeable delay. It only takes 2 minutes to set up this mirroring tool. Now there is one thing which I recommend before you start streaming that is to just tap on your profile icon in any mirror and sign in or sign up with an iMovie ID. Because after you create an iMovie account you can unlock the standard features where you can mirror display for 40 minutes per day. But if you want to unlock more privileges then you can definitely buy the iMovie any mirror pro subscription. So let me just go ahead and log into my account with pro subscription for demonstration. There are also many benefits of mirroring mobile display to a PC monitor. For example, if you are a streamer on YouTube where you stream mobile games or if you want to edit videos on mobile apps like CapCut but on a bigger display, all of that can be done with the help of this tool. Now let me show you guys how to mirror or stream your Android screen using a Wi-Fi connection. The first step is to use the AnyMirror mobile app. The second step is to open it and select Wi-Fi connection on its homepage. And the last step is to connect it with your PC. You can also directly connect by just scanning a QR code. So on your mobile phone, open Play Store or App Store and search for any mirror and open it. Make sure that you are connected with the same Wi-Fi which you are using on your PC. After that, open the Wi-Fi connection tab and just tap on OK and only this time. Now you will see your PC in the connectable devices sections. So click on connect and then click on start now. And there we go, we have successfully mirrored our screen using Wi-Fi connection. And surprisingly, there is still no noticeable delay. So let's try playing one of the biggest battle royale games which is PUBG Mobile also known as BGMI and immediately you will notice how good the game looks and feels on a bigger display. By the way, if you are using Wi-Fi mirroring, then my tip would be to have a good connection so you don't get high MS while playing online games. Let me go into a team deathmatch and try to get a kill. The controls are super smooth, the game is streaming at literally 60 FPS with both audio and video being synced. And there we go, we have gotten our first kill. So in my opinion, mirroring your Android device is better than using some third-party softwares like Bluestacks which are clearly emulators and they require a high-end PC. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about this tool and if you are interested in it then check the link given in description box below. Again thanks to iMobi for sponsoring this video but everything I said were my honest opinions. See you guys next time, goodbye.